Today, I'm gonna dive in deep on what YouTube is as a platform, how to get started with YouTube trends, and how you can leverage on tools that can help you find the best keywords for your growth. So don't go anywhere and keep on watching. Here's why you should start considering YouTube as a platform. With over 2 billion active users, consumption is going up on an all-time high on mobile, desktop, and smart TVs. I'm not even kidding, even my parents are watching cooking videos on a smart TV. Yeah. So here's the thing, people are viewing content longer, which is ultimately YouTube's goal. Their goal is to increase watch time so that they have more ad space to help build businesses. So how do you exactly find YouTube trends? There are many resources to find the latest real-time updates on YouTube trends, but here are some of the more popular options. The first option is YouTube Trending Dashboard. So the YouTube Trending Dashboard highly depends on the user's country. And the second option that you should consider is the popular tab on YouTube's page. And with this page, you could see the global statistics. The third is using Google Trends for YouTube. And the fourth tool is using Keyword Tool for YouTube, which I'll further explain how to exactly find the best keywords for your YouTube videos. So do stay tuned for that. Knowing where to find and spot trends is not enough. You should also know how videos on YouTube become viral. Only then, you will be able to understand how to use all these current trends. Okay, so now let's go in deeper on finding the trending topics on YouTube. It's basically a place that shows a variety of videos that's trending and happening within your country or around the world. You will find content like new releases from artists, new trailers, gadgets that people are talking about at the moment, funny clips, and viral videos. However, you do actually have an option to change the country setting to a specific location to see what is popular within that region. So how does a video get ranked on YouTube? Being on YouTube trending page is definitely going to be a fierce competition. It's not gonna be easy, and often most appealing and unique videos only gets to be appeared on that page. YouTube trending aims to balance all of this with some of these considerations. Total and current view count, the rate of growth in views, where views are coming from, including outside of YouTube, example social media, blogs, media portals, and etc. and the age of the video. So here is what YouTube states. It states that these signals mean that the video with the highest view count on the given day may not be number one on YouTube trending, and videos with more views may be shown below videos with fewer views. Even if your video meets all of the above criteria, it may not appear on YouTube trending, as many other videos may also meet those criteria. So what this means is that the system will try to show more relevant content to their viewers. Yep, I mean, it does make sense when you look at a makeup video and probably another makeup video which pops up. And if you look at a food video and another food video pops up, that's basically it. Now, sourcing and tapping into trending videos. Pages like YouTube Trending and Popular on YouTube is a valuable resource for brands, marketers, or individuals that's planning to grow their brand on YouTube. It shows what is in trend right now and allows you to leverage off this trending topic to create content that would entice more viewers to watch as well. The data for these pages can be extracted by using Google Trends for YouTube or Keyword Tool for YouTube. These tools give you deeper insights into specific topics and search behaviors of viewers that can be filtered by time and location. Not only would you get a more detailed look onto the current trending topic, but also seasonal fluctuations that you can definitely tap into as well. Creating popular content can be great for short-term bursts in views. But understanding seasonal fluctuations in terms of its search behavior is something that can help you create content that has a long-term viewership potential. So what can you do with YouTube Trends data? 
you should be in the know on what is going on in your industry, your community, and exactly what's happening around the world. It will help you craft new content that is popular and is relevant to your target audience. Using Cure Tool for YouTube can be used as a base to build on new content. The data will show you high volume keywords, current popular topics, and seasonal fluctuations. You will definitely gain a better insight on your viewers' taste and consumer behavior. Now, how do you leverage on YouTube trends? And here I'm going to show you how. Now, the first step is to finding the trendiest topic. And you can do this by using Google News, YouTube trendings, popular page on YouTube, and our tool. The second step is to locate the source of the video, which in this case, YouTube. And the third step is to analyze the related keywords from the video. And this tool is going to show you exactly how you can do that. And now to do this, you can copy and paste a link that is really popular at the moment into the input field and press enter. In seconds, the results will show you related keywords that's associated with this particular video. So how to make sense out of all this data that you have collected? Find high volume keywords that are related to the video that you plan to create. So if you're planning to create a video, you can use this keywords as a way to create titles, description, hashtags, and even tags. And if you're planning to create an article or a blog post about the trending video, you can insert related keywords into the post. Now, all of this was done through the Analyze Competitor feature from Keyword Tool Pro. It's our paid subscription tool that allows you to do more than just finding keywords. So easily just copy the link and paste it on the search box and the results will show you all the related keywords of the video. This powerful method can be applied to a wide variety of topics and help you give new topic ideas. At the same time, it can help you with the searchability of your content on Google and YouTube. Now let's dive in deep on creating seasonal content. Viral videos are often one-off events. Brands and marketers can choose to write on popular, trending topics or events. However, it only produces short-lived bursts of views. For more sustained growth on your channel, we do suggest tapping into seasonal fluctuations on search behaviors. Now here's how you can use Cure Tool for YouTube Trends to find seasonal fluctuation topics. Let's just say you're running a recipe food channel on YouTube. The Cure Peppermint shows a sizable monthly search volume that shows the largest spike that is found in December. Now this is data that can be used to your advantage. You can search your database on either global or any other countries in specific that is supported by Cure Tool. You will be able to spot seasonal fluctuations that can help you plan your content in time to create targeted content for your viewers. And this allows you to efficiently utilize resources for maximum impact. I hope that you try all these strategies and start implementing it for your channel because I believe it will definitely make a huge difference to the growth of your channel. And as always, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Click on the notification button so that you will not miss out on our next content. Enjoy the rain, guys. Bye! Compared to all searches on all... On all topics. <laughs>